Well, hello, glorious people of the interwebs, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Today, we're going to be doing another bounty. This is part of the full bounty series that we got going on on the channel. And I had no idea there was one bounty left that I had yet to do on the channel. And I just unlocked it in Chapter 4, and it is a bounty in Rhodes. So we're going to be checking that one out today. I hope you all enjoy the episode. If you do, feel free to follow that like button. And if there's anything in particular you'd like to see on the channel in the future, feel free to let me know in the comments below. Now, we are going to finally be having a nice update to Red Dead Redemption 2 online on the 26th. While it's not going to bring much content, we are at least going to get the daily challenges, which should add some interest to free roam. Uh, so I'm actually really looking forward to that. Uh, this bounty... Did it just disappear? What the hell? How did that happen? It was literally right there. It was on the map. I'm... I'm at a loss for words. I don't know what happened. This is crazy. So I loaded up a previous save, and we still have a bounty here. And I know I hadn't done it yet. It shows the Alliance Green on there, but it's not actually Alliance Green. And this is in Rhodes. I wonder if I can pick it up while I have a bounty on me. I can't believe it just disappeared. It was there when I put the marker down, got into there. Now, I did walk in there during my live stream earlier today, and the poster was there, so I know it's a thing. But maybe you have to get it like within a certain amount of time of entering chapter four. I have no idea. If you guys have had any issues with bounty posters just randomly disappearing for no apparent reason, uh, let me know in the comments below. I've never seen that happen before. And um, maybe that's why I've missed out on bounties in the past. I have no idea. We're going to run back to Rhodes and see if this thing is there this time. This is officially the strangest thing ever. Uh, I camp for a couple days. It, it pops back up and then I come over here and it disappears. Oh, oh, there we go. It disappeared off the map, but it is still there. What is this? $2 reward. What is this? This changed too. This was somebody else when I saw it during my stream earlier. Wanted a live $2. Doc w Wormwood? Wait, what? No. What is this? This is so weird. $2 reward. Wanted for most heinous series of murders by poisoning. The imposter uh, physician peddles his vile and toxic concoction. Okay. But this... This is the, this is the weirdest thing I've ever experienced. Okay, so I had to load all the way back to my very first save in Chapter 4 to be able to get this done. And we finally got it. So we got Mark Johnson here. Let's grab this handy-dandy poster and see exactly what this bad mamba jamba's wanted for. Of going after them, are you? I'd wager you're more than up to it. All right. Uh, who evaded capture years ago I and is still, uh, still at large. He's to be captured yard. alive. Last seen in Stillwater Strand. What did he do? Ah, for stage and train robberies. Okay, cool. Cool beans. Um, yeah, we'll get rid of that horrible save that's apparently broken. Or trying to, up by Stillwater Strand. He's a bad egg. Fancy that. You're also a bad egg, though. Going here, and I never had an inkling. Oh, hello. Been a while since you were around this way. What did he do with his hands? God, his voice just freaks me out. Okay. So we know he's in Stillwater Strand. I, I can't believe there were so many issues just getting this bounty. I was like, you know, this is going to be a nice, smooth episode to record. I'm not going to have to worry about nothing. Arthur, quit caring about all the strangers, man. So Stillwater Strand, how far away is this place? Now, this should be the very last bounty as... Not, not in the game, like, currently where I am in Chapter 4. Obviously, there's uh, epilogue stuff, but I have covered those on my first playthrough. So this should be the very last bounty that I have not done in the game. Although, there is one particular bounty that if you let the person go alive, yeah. you can find them later in the game. And I did that in the live stream, so that is still one that I have to cover. Uh, so there's a character that if you let him go alive, later on you can catch him for a bounty for uh, some decent money. Jeez. Oh. That buck sacrificed himself to the greater good. Son of a... 
bitch! Oh my god, instant karma! Where did that rock come from? Horse, are you okay, man? Sweet baby Jesus! That'll teach me to just... Technically, the buck killed itself. I... I mean, I didn't even do that on purpose. I mean, I do love to run over deer, but that one wasn't even on purpose. I did that buck a service. He asked to die. I did not ask to get... to run into a rock? Anyways, we're almost near where this is. Now, if there is anything in particular you guys would like to see on the channel, feel free to let me know in the comments below. We have been messing a lot with Tubby McTubberson, aka the guy from the incest couple. Have I done this one before? Maybe I have. I'm not 100% sure. You get this right. I can't, Daddy, please. Ooh. Let him in. He's been trying for hours. He ain't no kind of man till he can get on a horse. <laughs> I remember these guys I can't now. can't do it, Daddy. He's spent. Let him rest. My son ain't no quitter. Do it again, boy. <laughs> My arms are like rope. What? Leave it, Billy, please. He ain't trying is all. Again, boy. Get up on that horse. Jesus. The most pathetic kid ever. Put your foot in the stirrup and get up on that horse. Look at him. He's worn through. He will be if he don't get up there. I just want to see him get kicked by the horse, is all. Is any dialogue going to change? I'm, I'm sorry, Pop. I'm... Oh, the boy's crying. I ain't raising no goddamn sissy. This is just bad. Would you end this madness? Okay. Okay. Go get there next try. He's like a full grown dude almost. <gasps> They're here for your bounty. <gasps> Come to mama, boy. <gasps> Don't shoot. I'm an arm. We knew you was coming. I got something to ask. I'm a changed man, okay? Let me say my farewells. I'll come away peaceable. Now the question it's is... Boy. Do we want to capture him now or, or capture him later? Just a few words. Huh? Make it quick. That's You're the real question me. here. Boy. Boy, come here. Listen. I feel exactly like we should... Say. You hear? Don't. Don't. I ain't gonna fight you in front of my family. Okay? Are you going to wait till your family leaves? Is he going to follow me? I don't think he is. Okay. It's just, uh... want to take me. Take... Hog time. There we go. Bastard! Don't look away, boy. You remember this moment. Has he got anything on him? Now. Be a man, boy. This is, uh, very kind of you. Come on, In my man. first playthrough, I let him go. Enough with that. Just remember what I said, boy. I wonder where his family goes afterwards. Uh, there's a lot of curious things. Like, if you did decide to let him go, like, where would they go, I wonder? Would they go immediately, like, rob something, probably? What? <laughs> That'd be pretty funny if that was the case. I mean, Rhodes is pretty close, so this is a pretty straightforward bounty. But I do like a little backstory. This is the only one that just comes willingly, which is pretty cool. Oh, whoa, what the crap? How'd he get free? You rascally son of a bitch. How did he get free? As I was saying, a pretty straightforward bounty. And then he breaks free of the ropes. Guy, who is he? Houdini? Jesus. Oh, we, gotta, we might want to actually see this guy hang. We haven't watched a lot of hangings in the game. I watched all the ones in the epilogue. 
Now what was the point in all that? Oh crap! Oh, we're definitely gonna watch this guy hang. Did his family? His family totally went and told his gang members. I think that's all your friends, ain't it? You shouldn't have done that. And now look what's happened. Dead because of you. Damn it. I knew you was being quiet. Yep. I'm not a fan of this guy now. We're totally gonna watch him hang. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be the best thing ever. Is, Guts. He, is he gonna say anything? Guts. What? Just you're real quiet back there. <laughs> Most captured men, on. they beg or they Won't cry or they to rail against fate. Love me my peace. Okay. That's surprising. I like that Arthur had the same thought process as me. I was like, man, this guy's super duper quiet for some reason. You're almost shot him. I'm ready. I hope they make it quick. I hope they don't. I wonder how long it's going to take for him to hang. Going to sit down. Eat some popcorn and watch the show. Right, maybe I should do like a montage of like all the hangings in the game. Then I'd have to replay everything though. Which wouldn't be a bad Found thing. Found this fella on a small holding. Name's Mark Johnson. You can only run so long, son. There's your cell. You're lucky it's not a grave. I was out in a fight. Wasn't hurting no one. Maybe you weren't. But those partners of yours were a rough bunch. Go to hell. What a douche canoe. All right, Sheriff Douche Canoe Gray. Where's my money, good sir? That's the price for Johnson. I didn't take it. Someone else would have. You tell yourself that, bounty hunter. You ain't whiter than white. I hope your past catches up with you. I oh, built yeah? a home. Out in godforsaken country. <laughs> Land no one would want. I made amends, I promise. You'll find redemption in a chain gang. Or on the end of a rope, that's all. Sheriff Gray wants to hang him, man. We'll be offering a price on another outlaw very soon. Ooh. Check the station presently. Nice. Very nice. Anyways, I do hope you all enjoyed the episode. I love the bounty hunts in this game. I really hope we get some sort of like DLC that gives us some kind of like procedurally generated bounties even online i think it would be pretty cool like just instead of having missions just give us bounties every once in a while to do you know people are committing atrocities all the time even just name them after like players like the the player system that we have right now um with the update that's coming out people who do bad just create an npc that's named after those and we can get some revenge i don't know i think it's a fun little idea but thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one